Cockney rhyming slang is dead, let's face it. The world needs a new kind of urban language to communicate with and being the nice guy I am, I've come up with one for you. It's called footballer name slang. So you know how Cockney rhyming slang works where you take a phrase that rhymes with something you want to say and you say that phrase instead, like instead of stairs, you say apple and pears. Well, that's rubbish, okay? How footballer name slang works is you take the first name of a footballer whose surname means the word you want to say. So to demonstrate, uh, if you wanted to say something was untidy, you'd say, this place is absolutely Lionel, because it's messy, right? Or if you wanted to talk about money, you could say, yeah, you can buy this car, mate, but it's gonna cost you about 50 Raheem, because it's Sterling, yeah? Lionel, Messi, Raheem, Sterling, you get it. So to make things easier for you, I've put together a little scene that includes all the common examples of footballer name slang in one go. Try and keep up now, won't you? You got the Raheem? Yeah, I got the Raheem. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Nicky, the thing is, I need a little Bobby. You need Bobby? Nicky, that's not what we agreed. It doesn't Juan what we agreed. If you want to buy my Vincent, I'm going to need Bobby Raheem, all right? Mate, please, don't be so tin. Have a joe. Do you know how many Gordons I had to rob to get that Raheem? Well, you're going to have to rob a few Bobby Gordons, aren't you? And you're going to have to do it quick, because I need the Raheem fast. Why? What's the Ian? I need it for my brother. He's been arrested. I've got to post his Gareth. Didn't know you had a brother. Yeah, you did. You know him. He's the one with the, you know, Shane David. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know the one. He was the one that always used to wear that leather Kenny. Yeah. Yeah, we used to go down the G-Sang when we were kids, and then uh, did a bit of Andy singing at Christmas time. What's he been up to? Well, he ain't been Andy singing for a while, that's for sure. He's got himself mixed up in some pretty Lionel stuff, actually. The police have been on the knoll for him for ages, and they finally caught him last week when he was in a Denver fight. So I find myself in a pretty Kieran situation. Basically, I've got to use the Raheem I'm getting from selling my Vincent just to post my brother's Gareth and get him away from all those Darren boys he's been locked up with. You get me? Yeah, I get ya. Look, I'm not Luke about this. Nicky, I like to think of myself as a bit of a Mark person. And we all make mistakes. What do they say? No man is a Stephen. So as it's your brother, with the Shane David and the Lever Kenny, I hope you are. Plus, I'm pretty Robbie to get this Vincent. But I'll tell you what, I'll make up the extra Raheem, you chuck in your Aston Russell. Bill? Are you joking me? You think I'm gonna give you my Aston Russell? I'll give you my Robert Kazuki. Okay, I'll take it. Nicky, I don't carry that sort of Raheem around with me, so uh, you're going to have to take a pair. I can take a pair. May I add, I think you've handled this situation very Tom. You've shown a lot of Andre. Thanks, pal. No problem, but you need to leave now before the authorities get us. I'll keep this. And that, my friends, is a little bit of footballer name slang. I hope you've enjoyed it, but more importantly, I hope you've learned from it. Feel free to go forth into the universe and use that in any way you, you please. Just make sure you credit me and send me royalties in, in cash or, or check. I do take petters. Uh, thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel if you like football and you like people being silly and if you like just helping me get more subscribers. Bye.